Good morning. In this presentation, we are going to see how we can trade in MCX Gold for this week. Before looking into that, let us see what happened last week and what we expected last week. The chart which you are viewing is an 1 hour chart. That means every single candlestick here represents 1 1 hour. And this uh, dotted vertical line, so you can see, always indicates the price opening and closing for the respective days. Uh, so on Monday, the uh, gold market opened around 29,920. You can see this is the zone where the market opened uh, around Monday. And we expected that the gold can continue its uh, downtrend because on Friday you can see the price was dropping and it closed lower. So we expected gold to continue its downtrend having 30,020 as a major resistance zone. So after the price opening, the market went up near 30,000 and it tried to test this 30,020 and exactly it came down and closed lower. On Tuesday also, we expected gold to continue its downtrend. So it opened around uh, 29,950s and again it tried to test this 30,000 and the failure again pushed the market down. You can see the price dropped down and it came down till 29,720. After that also we expected the price to continue its uh, selling. So you can see the next day also the price opened around 29,800 and uh, you can see the price was initially testing this 29,860 and it came down till 29,780 and, uh, 29, and it gave some pullback uh, and it went up till 29,920. So on Thursday we made a change uh, in our uh, analysis and we expected the price to move higher. So we expected that the gold can continue can uh, stop the downtrend and we expected there can be a possible reversal in trend. So if you have any doubt what is the reason why we expected this, you can go back uh, You can go back to our website and you can see the archives of what we had posted last week. So what happened was that the price opened around 29,880 and it went up and broke this key zone. We were targeting this key zone of 29,900 and 29,920 which uh, we expect this to provide a possible uh, support so what happens is that after the price opening the price stayed up and it took some resistance around 29,960 because uh, uh, a failure to sustain above 29,960 pushed the market down till 29,000 you can see 29,760 so it took the resistance here and again it entered into the key zone of 29,900 and 920 where we expected the market to provide some support and what happened is that the price provided a support and it went up and closed about 29,960. The next day on Friday the price opened up and it went up and tested this to 30,020. We know that 30,020 is a very potential resistance zone that clearly provided a resistance and push the market again into this 29,900 zones where it provided a clear support again that pushed and broke this 30,020 which is a major resistance for gold market uh, and stayed above that and closed above this zone and the market finally had a closing above this uh, 30,020 and what happened was that uh, the market gold market exactly went uh, with our expectations uh, so uh, what we can uh, do for this week is that the expected price opening for today is also more or less near the same zone and there is no difference in our strategy we go for a buying till 29,920 and have this zone unless until we see the price uh, move clearly above 30,020 but we surely don't want any uh, price action below 30,020 that can seriously provide some pressure selling pressure around this zone but still we expect that the gold can sustain buying and i have we have drawn the trend line also so we can have we have connected all the lows up so sorry uh, we have connected uh, this low and this low and also which is uh, connecting and staying in line with the trend we expect that the market even if the price is for moving here and there we expect the market will be provided with 9960 support also so this is the zone um, we still expect the price has got a potential to move and stay in uptrend but based upon the price action which is going to happen for this week 
it may be subjected to changes and uh, daily watch our videos uh, and if there is any change in the trend or anything we will surely uh, explain in depth uh, what is uh, what had happened uh, based upon the price action even we can reverse our view also so as of now comparing the price action gold looks good for buying till 29900 zone and if the after the price moving and clearing this 30020 completely we will increase our stop loss uh, we know it is a 100 point stop loss but surely there is no other option because given the price volatility in gold there is no other option left and the possible targets are 30,120 initially and possibly if the trend goes it can move to 30,200 zones also so let us see what's going to happen during our trading session and thanks a lot for watching our videos happy trading take care bye